and welcome to my channel and if you welcome are you ready for today's makeup look inspired by a flower I hope you are because today we are going to do this rowley pop flower let me show you it has some beautiful orange red and yellow color so that's what what we are going to do today uh, my son is here around and he's playing come say hey say hi hi look over there there. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> so if you hear him playing around, I hope you don't mind. Let's zoom in and start the makeup look. So for today's look, we're going to use three palettes. I'm going to use the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill palette, my Nix Ultimate Eyeshadow palette, and Sleeks Eye Divine, and this is on the horizon. So let's start with the Jaclyn Hill palette. And we are going to take the first shade all over the lid and it's going to be the one that it's called uh, In Light, just like a base for our sh shadows. And I already have the foundation and everything on and my uh, eyelid primer, but it's starting to crease. Let's just set that with some eyeshadow. Well, this is a little bit shimmery. Yes, it is. Oh. We'll fix that. I didn't really know that this was a shimmery shade, but let's let's go with that. Okay, let's take uh, this shade called Silk Cream in the crease, and we are using Zoeva two two eight crease brush. I feel like my light is a little bit strange. I don't know. My, the sun is kind of disappearing. Now I'm going to take this Eye Divine eyeshadow palette, uh, the Sleek Makeup on the Horizon palette, and I'm going to take uh, this third color also in the crease. I feel like I'm a little bit too yellow right now, but let's continue. I had, had to close down the curtains because the sun was kind of the sunlight was kind of off. But I'm going to go into this yellow one and go all uh, yeah, well in the crease of course. I'm going to take it a little bit high. Now I took this yellow shade a little bit higher than my crease. Okay, let's go then into the next uh, deeper yellow shade with the same crease and take it just slightly and uh, not as high as the first one. And then we're going to take this orange shade and put that in the crease. Can you see how we created those eyeshadows now? Now we are going to go, let me see the flower again. Now we have to go into the deeper orange and reds. If you can see, I'm going to take like this brush and take the red one from the NYX palette. This one is a little bit shimmery, but we'll make it work. This one turns out more like purple than the red or pink. And I want to go back into this orange shade again. 
and blend it more in the crease. Then I'm going to go into this palette again and go to that color Jazz. Try to make it more deeper red. Just at the edge. I think this looks good now. I'm going to take the red from mix again and slice it slightly back it on here. We're going back a little bit with that orange shade again and just blend, but I still want this line with the red eyeshadow. I'm going to take this brush and take this yellow on the lightest and pack this here. It's not really showing as bright as I would like it to. Let's try to take a little bit of the Fix Plus. Maybe that will work. We are going back to the sleek palette and going to take this shimmery yellow one. And just place that a little bit here. Just to make it pop more. So then what I'm going to do is to, I took this the smallest that I could find. Uh, Hunts from Jack and Him and Morphe palette. Can I create small dots if I can? And I'm going to take this uh, yellow and this orange and put under my lower lash line. Then I'm going to take this darker shade and place that. So, I don't know if you can see, but here there are some greens and I'm going to take my new green eyeliner pen and this is Long Lasting Eyeliner Excess Intensity from Max Factor. This one looks very weird. So guys, this is the final look. I think it looks very close to the real flower. Or shades, colors of course. But I do like how it turned out and I'm happy how it turned out. Thank you so much for watching. Give a thumbs up if you like these kind of videos. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in my next video. Bye!